So even though it's like now, the, all the forest line, the, the lighting is crossed over, you still can see very bright under the, the, the resolution. And the contrast is to 1 point, 2.5 to 1 contrast ratio. Okay. So roughly, uh, maybe you want to show some. Okay, uh, if you feel this projection is too bright, right? Uh, using the eco function. Okay, for the brightness setting, if you feel this uh, projection is changing, right. too quiet. So it will dim a little bit, but you still can see uh, sharp, still sharp, and still like the color still vibrant. Okay. Or you can change to extended. If you change to extended, this can extend the life of projector up to 30k, 30,000 hours. Yeah. And then if you the the room is still like you feel this still bright, you can go to custom and set the brightness by yourself. Right now it's 70, uh, 77%. You can go down until 70%. You can control the brightness using the custom function. You can check the info of the projector. So for this projector info, you can uh, ignore the information like how many hours this projector already run uh, and then what the source is being uh, shown right now and what is the resolution and the most important thing is the serial number <laughs> yeah because uh, if you have issue with the, with the projector you can call the customer service and you can give them the serial number to check how long you still have a warranty or and then what what is the next machine they can or uh, what service they can provide to tackle your issue. Okay. Another um, <laughs> another features for this projector, we have this uh, function we call it we call the, the direct power on off. This direct power on off actually when you enable this function you can direct switch on or off the projector direct from the power source so let's say if the, you're using this projector at home and the, the, you have small kids they don't know how to switch on the projector or turn off uh, the correct way you can use these features and they can turn on or off the projector direct from the power source it won't damage the projector and then uh, this projector also has features we call split screen. Okay, so you can uh, project two different uh, content from two different sources simultaneously using this uh, split screen function. So, any questions so far? Okay, so some other. From this um, split screen, right, you can uh, choose either you want to, the screen size you want to be equal or you want to make the left larger or vice versa. So this is very good uh, if you're, you have a family, you have a two brothers at home. So one's playing game one, game two, you won't quarrel, you won't fight thing. So you have a two source because you have three HDMI in. So at the same time, you can project both the same screen but different uh, input, three HDMI in. Um, and 
also I want to add on one uh, main uh, selling point for this ultra short tone projector is use uh, laser technology. Okay, so in the commercial we use lamp bulb and laser technology. Lamp bulb is when you reach certain hours, for example three thousand hours, then you change the lamp bulb. That's the maintenance cost for the, the, the lamp projector. For laser, like this, this is 20,000 hours laser. It's using laser diode assembly to build inside the projector itself. So after 20,000 hours, so then you want to use by zero. So uh, even though this is engineering model, but this, you can say it's a complete model, but it comes with affordable price. So the resolution is one uh, NED, similar with the LS100. And then um, it comes with built-in Wi-Fi, and Miracanacas, Miracanacas is actually is the, the built-in features inside the smart devices. And then when you're using Miracanacas, it's mirror whatever you have the content inside the devices. Let's say if you already connect to a projector using Miracanacas, the content what you see on your devices will pop up at the projector. Let's say you open your WhatsApp and uh, email or anything, it will project out. But if you're using uh, Wi-Fi, using the app application, you need to choose the content. Let's say you need to choose the picture, you need to choose the PDF, then only it will project out. That's the difference between Miracast and Wi-Fi. Okay, it also have a lens shift for this model. So you can um, shift the projection level without moving the projector. Okay. So thank you Rafi. So that is our entry model 5650. Let's come to this model, it's our big range. Uh, basically this few models is better, uh, depends on your room size and what's the screen size, what the spec you, you're looking for. So of course by, uh, the higher contrast the better. Okay. The brightness is depends on your environment, which model you choose. So now we have an entry, we have a uh, mid-end. Of course our, don't forget our advanced model, our hero model today. Uh, nice one. 9400 yes. and 7400. So the this